Hello there. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Good evening. How do you feel? How was your day? Good. Tiring. Do you feel happy? How do you say estresado in English? Estresado? Stressful. Marco. Stressful, entonces. Muy okay. <laughs> Very stressful. Okay. What about your day, Irma? A uh, heavy day. A heavy day? Difficult day? Oh my yes. God. Okay. And you, Yvette, yes. how was your day? Uh, very fine. Okay. It was good. Okay. All right, so well, good evening, Erika, Marcelo, Suleima, Erebin, Luis. Okay. All right, guys. So I'm happy that you are right here. So welcome. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, Luis. Got it. Um okay. Let me just okay. Then today we're going to start with our class, and we have the quote of the day and Irma. Help us reading the quote of the day. Okay. It's the, the capacity mm -hmm. to nurse if a gift they are. Ay, esa palabra. The ability. Ability to nurse is a skill. The Willing, willingness. Willing, willing, willingness. 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 Yes. To learn is a choice. Yes. Okay. So the capacity to learn is a gift. Okay. La capacidad de aprender es un regalo. Okay. So it's a gift. The ability to learn is a skill. La habilidad para aprender es una habilidad. And the willingness, what is the meaning of willingness? Willingness means la buena disposición, willingness. So the willingness to learn is a choice. ¿Qué quiere decir? Que la, dispos la disposición, la buena disposición para aprender es una elección. Okay? And that is true. That is true. Okay? Eso es muy cierto. You can have many opportunities. Puede tener muchas oportunidades, pero si no tienen la buena disposición, no existe ni la habilidad ni nada, right? So don't forget about that. The capacity to learn is a gift. The ability to learn is a skill. And the willingness to learn is a choice. Una elección. A choice, una elección. Okay? So today we are going to start with the warm up. Then we have vocabulary, we have grammar, we have speaking, we have many things. And today we have a short quiz, okay? Tenemos un pequeño quiz, un examen. So we are going to start with a tongue twister. And this goes like this. Pay attention, okay? Listen to me. Fuzzy Woozy was a bird. Fuzzy Woozy had no hair. Fuzzy Woozy wasn't very fuzzy, was he? Okay, once again, okay, una vez más. Fuzzy Woozy was a bird. Fuzzy Woozy, esa Z, Z had no hair. Fuzzy Woozy wasn't very fuzzy, was he? Okay. Is it difficult? So so. Easy. So so. <laughs> okay, easy. That's the attitude. Okay, easy, teacher. That's easy. Okay. So let's see. One by one. Okay. Uno por uno lo va a decir. One by one. So Irma, you go first. Then Marco. Okay, Irma, go. Fussy, fussy was beer. Fussy, fussy, at no here. 
Pussy, pussy, once very pussy, was he? Okay. Also, okay, don't forget. Bear and hair. Bear, hair. Yes. Marco. Fussy Woozy was a bear. Fussy Woozy had no hair. Fussy Woozy hasn't very fussy. Has she? He, perdón. Was he. Okay, was he. very good. Okay, very good, Marco. Yvette. Fussy Woozy was a bear. Fussy Woozy had no hair. Fussy Woozy wasn't very fussy. Was he? Yes. Very good, Yvette. Okay, well done. Irvin. Pussy Goosey was a bear. Pussy Goosey had no hair. Pussy Goosey wasn't very pussy, was he? Yes. Okay. Don't forget, this is bird. Okay. Bird. Erika. Pussy Goosey was a bear. Pussy Goosey had no hair. Pussy Goosey was very pussy, was he? Mm hmm okay. Wasn't very fuzzy, was he? Okay, uh, let me see, uh, Marcelo. Busy Busy was a beer. Busy Busy and uh, no ear. Busy Busy was very busy, was he? Okay, all right. So remember, Fuzzy Woozy was a bird, a bird, okay? Pussy Woozy had no hair. Pussy Woozy wasn't very fuzzy, was he? And let me see, Suleima. Pussy Goosey was a bear. Pussy Goosey had no hair. Pussy Woozy was, wasn't very fuzzy, was he? Yes, very good. Okay, excellent. Do you remember about the one that we um, studied yesterday? Do you remember a big, a big black bug with a big black dog on his big black nose? Do you remember about that one? Or no? I don't know. Okay, so we need to practice that one as well. Okay, guys, we are going to move to vocabulary. And today we are going to talk about body parts. Okay, body parts. Yes. So we have the first one, which is head. What is the meaning of head? Cabeza. Yes, head. We also have eyebrow. Eyebrow, which is ceja. Eyebrow. 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 Okay, then we also have boca, mouth. Mouth. Mouth, okay. We have nose, nose. We also have eye, eye, okay. Ear, your ear, yes. Then we also have pen, pen. We also have the arm, el brazo, the arm, yes. Then we have leg, leg. What is leg? Pierna, yes? Leg. We have lip, okay? Your lips, los labios, yes? We also have tongue, which is tongue, lengua. And foot, pie. Okay, so now, Repeat after me. Head, eye, ear, hand, arm, leg, eyebrow, nose, mouth, lip, tongue, and foot. Yes? So let's see, Marco, how do you say lengua? How do you say lengua in English? No, I don't know. Here, 
let's see. I'm sorry, uh, tongue. Tongue, very good. Yvette, how do you say boca? Boca, in English. Boca. Mouth. 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 Yes. Irving, how do you say ceja? I'm broke. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Marcelo, how do you say mano? Hand. Hand, yes. Okay, how do you say oreja, Marco? Ear. Ear, very good. Okay, body parts. Of course, there are many. For example, how do you say cabello? Cabello, hair, 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 cabello, yes. Then how do you say, guys? How do you say pestañas? Pestañas. Lashes. Eyelashes, yes, okay, eyelashes. And how do you say párpado? Eyelid, eyelid, párpado, yes? And, okay, how do you say codo? Now, okay, elbow. And how do you say rodilla? Now, okay. Knee. How do you say hombros? No. Shoulders. Mm -hmm. How do you say dedos? Fingers. Fingers. Very good. Mm -hmm. And how do you say, okay, so fingers son los dedos de las manos. Pero ¿cómo se dice los dedos de los pies? Finger pots. Okay, no, actually we call them toes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Don't forget about that vocabulary, okay? No se olvide ese vocabulary, okay? All right, so we are going to start with the book and we are going to start by talking about prepositions again, okay? So we have prepositions right there, okay? So we have how to use prepositions of time. So let's see, Erebin, help us reading on, Yvette in, and Irma at. On Saturday, mm -hmm. on January and twenty-three. Okay. On Monday, February five, fifth. fifth. On when Wednesday, Wednesday morning. Okay. In. In. In May, in two. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo se dice? Two. Okay, two thousand <laughs> In the summer, in the morning. Okay, at. Irma. At two thirty. At two thirty. At noon, at noon, at noon, at night, at, at night. at midnight, midnight. Okay, guys, this is 2018. How do you say 2018?
now. Okay, so we say 218. Oh no, eso es, eh, if you say 218, is 218. But 2000, 2000, 2018, 2000. So, um, how do you say 100? 100. 100, okay. How do you say 126? 127. Oh no, 126. 100. 100. Yeah. 20 or 20, 20. 26. 26. Six. Very good. So now, how do you say 321? 321. 321. And how do you say 1211? 11. Mm -hmm. Any idea? One, one thousand, eleven, one, one thousand two hundred eleven. Yes, one thousand two hundred eleven. So, how do you say two thousand twenty two? Yes, two thousand twenty two. So how do you say diez mil ten thousand? Yes. So you see, it's not difficult, right? It's not difficult. Now, teacher, and how do you say mil novecientos noventa y ocho? One thousand nine hundred ninety-eight. Ninety-eight. Very good. Yeah. Yes. So one thousand nine hundred ninety-eight. Okay. So in English, guys, what we can do? Okay. Lo que podemos hacer? We can say um twenty twenty-two. Si a usted le cuesta decir las cantidades largas de esta manera, eh, eh, es Muy, pero muy importante que sepa cómo leer cantidades largas. For example, 2022. Pero también usted se puede ahorrar decir 2022 y puede decir 2022. Ok, puede decir 1998. Puede decir 1211. Ok. Pero es muy importante que sepa leer las cantidades largas, así como está aquí, 1,211, 1,998, 2,022, 10,000. Yes, it's really important. But okay, so right now we are going to continue with this, okay? So we are going to complete the email using prepositions of time. And we are going to compare the answer with a classmate. In this case, we are going to do it here, okay? So from, Erben, can you please help us reading from? Uh, Erben Peraza at gmail.com. Perfect. Two, Yvette. Mary uh, Yimba. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Underscore. Underscore. Okay. Mary Anderson Sue at at email.com. Okay. The subject new products presentation. Okay, so let's let's resolve it. Okay. So hello Fatima. 
Are you busy? Which preposition goes right there? Are you busy? Which preposition? On Monday. On, okay. So, are you busy on Monday afternoon? Very good. Next, do you know about the new product that the company launches? What is the meaning of launches? Lanzar, okay. There is, or there's, the contraction, there is a presentation about it, and it sounds very interesting. It starts, preposition? At. 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 Very good. At. Uh -huh. I work until. Si usted quiere decir, yo trabajo hasta las cinco, ¿cómo lo dice? I work until five. Hasta, until. Until. Hasta. But I can meet you. I can meet you. Preposition. I can meet you at, at, at six, right? At six. On the corner. On the corner of First Avenue and Main Street. What do you think? There is another presentation, but it will be from, from March, on, on March, March, from March to Sunday. On Sunday. In or on? In from. March on Sunday. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, all right. So let me ask you: If you say in, tell me why. Si dice in, por qué? Why? Why? Why in and no on? Sería on. Okay, ¿por qué on and no in? Porque creo que es un nombre propio. Porque solo se está diciendo el mes. On si es día. Mes y fecha. Very good. Yes, okay. So, in because we are just talking about the month. We are not giving a specific date. Very good. And then we have a day of the week, which is on Sunday. Yes? Sunday. All right. So let's see. Um, Franklin, help us reading the paragraph. Help us reading the paragraph. Read all of this. Todo, léalo. Read all of this. Hello, Fatima. Um, are you listening on Monday afternoon? Mm -hmm. Do you work a book the new product at the company uh, launch? What a presentation a book in and sound very interest interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, it start at six thirty six day. I work. Uh, until, no sé cómo se pronuncia eso. Until, until, no, until, until uh, five, four, six, forty-five, forty-five. But I can meet you at six on the corner of first, of first, avenue, avenue. No sé uh, main street. Ah, una calle. What do you uh, think? think? Where yeah. another presentation would it will be in March on Sunday? In a cat at day. I can that day. Okay, so repeat after me and say busy. 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 Be busy. Okay, then repeat after me and say about, about, about. Then say sounds. Okay, this is an observation. Esta es una observación en general. Cuando usted vea las S, aquí que tenemos S, S, miren, starts, tiene que pronunciarla porque si no, suena que usted está diciendo sound. A start. Y no, es 
it sounds, it starts. Y esa es una gran diferencia en su speaking. Porque si usted solo dice sound and start, entonces está pronunciando mal. ¿Ok? Tiene que ser bien cuidadoso con esas S. ¿Ok? So then we also have until. Until. Uh, and that's pretty much. Okay. This is a, oh, and this one, presentation. Presentation. Okay. Do you have any question about this? Questions? Doubts? Or no? Clear everything? Yes? Okay. So now let's move and let's continue. Remember that those are prepositions of time. Prepositions of time. Then we are going to create simple present information questions. Okay. Vamos a ver si se recuerda de las preguntas WH. A ver, ¿quién me puede dar un ejemplo con what? Uh -huh. Yes. Who can give me an example? An example with what? Uh, what? Podría ser what time is it? What time is it? Okay, very good. Yes. And if I ask you, Marcelo, what time is it? What time is it, Marcelo? Mm -hmm. Okay. What time is it? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What time is it? Somebody? Eight twenty seven. Okay, eight twenty seven. You can answer it. It's it's a twenty seven. Okay. Now, when an example with when when is uh, happy birthday? Oh, when is your birthday? When is your birthday? And Irma, when is your birthday? On um, July 12th. Okay, my birthday. My birthday is on July, is on July 12th. On July 12th. Okay, very good. So now, where? Where do you work? Where do you work? Okay, where do you work? And okay, so Ervin, where do you work? I work in Peru, Camille. In? No, yeah, I work in Peru. In Peru, so. Spell that for me. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Importadora in? Ramírez. Ramírez. Ok. Importadora. Ok. Ok. Why? An example with why? Why you happy? Why are you happy? Okay, why are you happy? Why are you happy? How can we answer? ¿Cómo podemos responder? Why are you happy? 
Uh -huh. I happy. I am happy. I am happy. I am happy. For happy. Three day. Oh, okay. So I am happy because porque it is is my day off. Oh, oh my god. Okay, off. Oh. Mire. I am happy because it is my day off. Estoy feliz porque es mi día libre. So, why es por qué en pregunta. And because es por qué en respuesta. Okay. So, if I ask you, why are you happy? Ah, I am happy because it is my day off. I am happy because I had a good day. I am happy because I have money. I am happy because I ate chocolate. Yes? Now, which? An example with which? Which? Which have an example? Which? Which is your? Which is your? Que viene siendo como igual que what, verdad? Yes, similar. Es como decir cuál es tu, ajá. Which is your? Which is your which is your favorite movie? Movie. Okay, so which is your favorite movie? Which is your favorite movie? My favorite movie is Sky Movie. <laughs> okay, my favorite. 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 My favorite movie is. Uh -huh. Let's add uh, my favorite movie is Shrek. Okay. Let's add Shrek. Okay. My favorite movie is Shrek. Now who? An example with who? Who is your teacher? Who is your teacher? And who is your teacher, Liliana? Who is your teacher? Your teacher. I. Is, um, uh, my teacher is. Miss. Miss. Is a mark. Yes, all right. Uh -huh. My teacher, okay, me, my. Yes, who is your teacher? Como la pregunta es, ¿quién es tu maestro? Usted responde, mi maestro o mi maestra es, y dice, okay. Por eso es my, my teacher is. Uh -huh. Do you have questions? ¿Tienen preguntas en relación a esto? Questions. Dudas. No. Okay. All right. So remember what, qué, when, cuando, where, dónde, why, por qué, which, cuál, who, quién. Okay, don't forget about this, que no se le olvide. Okay, don't forget, que no se le olvide. Okay, let's continue. Now, we are going to talk about prepositions of place. Okay, again, so we have different places right here. 
places, lugares. Places, lugares. Yeah, so listen to your teacher read the following places from the map. Bank, mall, restaurant, sport palace, sport palace, school, school, church, the city hall, city hall, ours company, and book world. So bank, bank, mall, el centro comercial, restaurant, restaurant, sport palace. What is a, what is a sport palace? Eh, sería como un gimnasio, no. Oh, no. No. The sport palace. Ajá. Uh -huh. Any idea? Artículo deportivo. Ok. Um, yes, the sport palace um, actually could be something like um, es el sport palace, guys, es como un es como un lugar donde usted puede ir y practicar diferentes deportes, right? The sport palace. The park. El parque. Arrows Company. Arrows Company. Esa es una compañía. Arrows, flechas. Es una compañía, right? Una compañía. School, colegio o escuela. Church, iglesia. City Hall, Alcaldía. City Hall. En Book World, The Book World es como decir eh, un lugar donde venden libros. Sí. Ok, yes, The Book World, el mundo de los libros. Ok. No es lo mismo que librería. Sí, es lo mismo que una librería. Es lo mismo que una librería. Ok, The Book World. Yes. Mm -hmm. And as you can see, we have a street and we have avenues. Tenemos streets, que son calles, y tenemos avenues, that are avenidas. A street and avenues. A street and avenues. A street, calle. Avenue, avenidas. Barrios, streets. First Avenue, Second Avenue, Roosevelt Street. You see? Now, let's move to this. So we have the prepositions of place to talk about addresses and places, direcciones, yes? So on Marcelo, in Marco, and at Erika. On four events, on the corner. Yes. On the street. Yes. In. In in El Salvador, mm -hmm. in San Salvador, in the park, in the no neighborhood. Neighborhood. Yes. At uh, at the mirror room, at where, at the bank. Thank you. Okay. So at the meeting. At the meeting room, at work, and at the bank. Thank you. Okay. So now, as you can see, 
in order for us to talk about avenues, corner or a street, we use on. Fíjese bien. Cuando utilizamos on, hablamos de las avenidas, de las calles y de las esquinas. Yes. On fourth avenue, en la cuarta avenida. On the corner, on the corner. Okay. En la esquina. On the street. On the street, en la calle. On the street. In El Salvador, countries, países. In San Salvador, cities. In the park, lugares. Okay. In the park, in the mall. Okay. In the park, in the mall, in the bank, in the restaurant, in the school, in the church. In, okay. At lugares específicos, specific places, specific places, específicos. At the meeting room, en la sala de reuniones, un lugar específico. At the meeting room, at work, en el trabajo. At work. At the bank, lugar específico, at the bank. Now, let's complete the location of each item using the correct preposition of place. Number one, I work. Which preposition? I work in the bank, that is? On. On, on First Avenue. On, on First Avenue because we use on for avenues. Very good. Number two, their factory is located. Una ciudad. The in factory. La libertad. In, okay. in La Libertad. In La Libertad. Number three. Number three. At. We yeah. see you at, 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 at a training, training at the room. training room. Okay, so now uh, we see you at the training room or at the cafeteria. At training room at, or in at the cafeteria. Or in at, or at? In the cafeteria. In, in the park, in the cafeteria. In the cafeteria, okay, like okay. that. Okay, so con esto le voy a explicar algo, okay? I'm going to explain something. It depends on the context, depende del contexto. Why? Because in this case, we use in when we are inside, cuando estamos dentro del lugar. Cuando estamos dentro, dentro del lugar, cuando estamos hablando de un lugar específico, no estamos adentro, solo estamos mencionando un lugar específico. Vamos a decir at, at. correcto. Uh -huh. Pero si usted está adentro del lugar, va a decir in. Por ejemplo, usted está en metrocentro, pero está adentro de MD. El lugar específico donde usted está es metro centro, pero después está dentro de, de otro lugar que es MD. Entonces, ¿cómo lo va a decir? I am. I am in metro centro at MD. No. 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 Yes. Sería I am at, at, at metro centro in MD. MD. Exacto, like that. Porque está dentro de MD. Es cierto que está en Metrocentro, pero está dentro de MD. Yes. So, depende del contexto. En este caso, we see you at, at the training room or aquí podemos decir at the cafeteria. Or podemos también decir in porque dejamos como la imaginación el contexto de esta oración. Pero hay ocasiones donde usted va a tener que elegir si es at or in. Usted va a tener que elegir. 
y mucho va a depender de toda la oración. Aquí es muy general. A veces las oraciones son más específicas. Okay. So, number four. Ana works in the company that is on the two in the town. In the town. Okay. In. In the town. Then, mm -hmm. In the town. In the town. Number five. My relatives. What is the meaning of relatives? Relatives mean. Relatives mean. Parientes. Parientes. My relatives, mis parientes, my relatives. My relatives go to the mall that is? On, 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 very good. Number six, tell him that we are, well, you have at, the answer, at the meeting room with everybody. Okay, yes. So, aquí está la respuesta. Yes, okay. So, right now. Let's continue. Let's continue. Do you have any questions? Tienen preguntas? No, right now? Okay, let's move. All right, so let's start then practicing the speaking in pairs. So we have a short dialogue. We have a short conversation. But first, I'm going to take the attendance, but I'm going to explain first what you are going to do. So we have this conversation. So one is going to be Will and the other one is going to be Tanya. You are going to practice speaking, yes? And then you are going to answer those three questions, okay? Let me, I'm going to, um, Irvin, help me please be Will and I'm going to be Tanya. Hello, can you help me? Where is the Millboard building? I don't live here. Don't worry, there are four buildings. Which one do you need? A uh, girl told me to go to the building on my street. I know it. It is down the street on the left side. Thanks. I have to ask you something. Is there a training center? There are a lot of training centers on the building between Main and King Street. I have some interviews there. Thank you. Thank you again. Bye-bye. Perfect. Very good. Don't forget pronunciation building. Okay. So right now we are going to practice with our partner. Okay. Vamos a practicar con su compañerito. Primero uno es Will. Después el otro es Will y se intercambian los papeles. Cuando ya hayan practicado esto, pair work. Respondemos esto. All right? But first I'm going to take the attendance. Okay? Eh, Brian Antonio Molina Castro. Cristian Marcelo Ramírez Morán. Present. Elmer Alexander Coto Sorto. Eric Alexander Escalante Barrillas. Erika Beatriz Reyes Méndez. Present. Thank you. Franklin Emanuel Flores Portillo. Uh, present. Thank you. Gerson Josué Abarca Aranda. Irma del Tránsito Alegría Martínez. Present. Thank you. Irving Francisco Peraza Herrera. Present. Thank you. Yvette Elvira Aquino Peña. Present. Thank you. Johnny Iván Argueta Argueta. José Enrique Siliesar Alas. Jocelyn Guadalupe Romero Évora. Kelvin Omar Martínez Ramírez. Liliana Beatriz Jiménez Colorado. Present. Thank you. Luis Ernesto Nuila Castro. Marco Rubén García Rodríguez. Present. Reinaldo Alberto Vázquez Torres. Tania Vanessa Moreno Navas. En Zuleima Guadalupe Chicas Aguilar. Present. Okay, thank you. All right, guys, so we are going to continue with this. Okay, remember, we are going to practice this. Okay, once you have finished this, cuando ya haya terminado esto, we are going to move on to this. 
complete the exercises with their is or their are. Okay. But first, this. Okay. That is first. So let me create the rooms. Let me create the rooms. And I'm going to assign. Okay. There you go. Let me see. Erema, you go with Erebin, Yvette, you go with Marco, Marcelo, you go with Liliana and Suleima. Uh, Luis, are you there? Can you help me? Where is the Melbourne building? I don't live here. Don't worry. There are four buildings. Which one do you need? I grill tool to me. Go to the building on Main Street. Mm -hmm. I know mm -hmm. it. It's down the street on the left side. Thank. Mm -hmm. I have to ask you some sometime. No, something. Else is there a training center? Mm -hmm. There are a lot of training centers on the bu building between mm -hmm. Main and King Street. Okay. I have some interviews there. Thank you again. Bye bye. Very good. All right. Yes. Re yes. Repeat after me before you you continue. Building. 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 Bil building. Building. Yes, continue. Building. Okay. Building. Okay. 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 Perdón. Yo. <laughs> Tranquilo. Okay. Hello. Can you help me? Where is the where is the Melbourne building? I don't like here. Don't worry. Don't there like are four buildings. Which one do you need? Mm -hmm. I need told me to go to the building on Main Street. I know it. It is it is down the street on the left side. Thanks. I have to ask time else is there a training center? There are a lot of training center of the building between me and the King Street. I have some interview there. Thank you, I guess. Bye bye. Ok. Seguimos. Lo... Sí, sí, sí. Para que. Para después. Que... Ajá. Y después uh -huh. contesta Marcos. Ok. okay. Bye. Eh, hello. Can you help me? Where is the Melbourne building? I don't live here. Don't worry. There are four buildings. Which one do you, one do you need? On the left side. Thanks. I have to ask you some time else. Is there a training center? Where mm. there are a lot of training center on the building Belching, May and we. Pregunta si cómo quiero ver según aquí. How many? Cuántos? How many? How many means cuántos? Cuántos? Uh, creo que sería ninguno. No sé si I don't. Oh, sorry. Four. There are four buildings. Yes. Es cierto. There are, ¿verdad? 
Sí, there are four buildings. Four. Building. Mm -hmm. Okay, la dos sería where is the building where we want to go to go to locate. Located. Located. Oh, located. Located. Y la building o building. 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 Ah, building. Okay. Teacher, ¿verdad que ahí sería, no sé si ahí sería eh, bu building between Maid a uh, King Street? Yes, yeah, so where is the building where Will wants to go located? Okay, so let me see. It says that... Um, with Maid and King Street? Uh -huh, between Maid and King Street. That is correct. Yes. Between me, ¿verdad? Yes. Mm -hmm. Entonces, de between sería la respuesta. A, where me. is the building? Yes, it is, it is, it is between. It is, is between Main and King Street. Sería it, it is o... Oh, eh, ¿Cómo se llama? Contracted. Eh, it's. Contracted. It. It's. Ok. Uh -huh. It be Queen Lee and King Street. Uh -huh. How many trading centers are there? Where are they? Where are they? Um. Mm -hmm. So how many training centers are there? I'm going to show you my, my screen, okay? So we can we can discuss it. Okay. So it says how many training centers are there, right? And where are they? So there are a lot of training centers on the building between Main and King Street. So there are a lot. Cuando usted dice a lot, son muchos. There are a lot. For example, si usted quiere decir, hay muchos perros. There, there are, are a lot of dog. A lot of? A lot of uh, the dog. Uh, no. I'm going to I'm going to write it here. Se lo voy a anotar aquí para que vayamos comprendiendo. There are a lot of dogs. Tiene que ser plural. Of dogs. Mm -hmm. There are a lot of dogs. Now, if we want to say, hay mucho gatos. There are a lot of gats. gats. There are a lot of A lot gats. of, of gats. Gats. Uh -huh. gats. There so, are a lot of, a lot of, a lot of, así es. A lot of. A lot of students. A lot of students. A lot of okay. students. Entonces sería how many training centers are, are there? Sería. There are there a are lot, lot of training centers. A yes. lot of training, training centers. A lot of. A lot. A lot of. A lot of. Yes. There are a lot of. Okay, a lot of. A lot of. Yes. A lot of training. Uh -huh. A lot of. Uh, lot of. Yes. Train centers. Centers. 
Mm -hmm. And where are they? Where are they? So they are they are on the building between Main and King Street. They are. Porque están diciendo, where are they? Where uh, are they? They are, they are on the building between Main and King Street. Um, Now, eh, ok, ahora, en la número dos, hay que leer, dice, Where is the building where Will wants to go located? ¿Dónde está el edificio que Bill, donde Bill quiere ir? Entonces, fíjese bien, aquí dice, A girl told me to go to the building on Main Street. Entonces, el edificio que él quiere ir, al que él quiere ir, está en el, it is on Main Street. Mm -hmm. Main Street. It is on Main on Street. Main Street. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. It is on Main Street. Mm. Okay. Okay. On Main Street. Main Street. Uh -huh. All right. I'm going to call you back to the main station because I'm going to explain something. Okay, give me one second. Okay, Franklin, you are Will, okay? Will, Franklin, you are Will. And let me see. And Liliana, you are Tanya. Franklin, Will, Tanya, Liliana. Okay. Uh, hello, can you help me? What is the Melbury building? I don't like where? I don't live. I to live where? Here. Here. Don't worry, red art for balding, which one do you need? Uh, you told me to go the building on Main Street. Mm -hmm. I, I know it is on the street on the left side. Yes. Yes. It's time I have to have you something else. Is where a training center? There are a lot, a lot of training center on the building between May and King Street. Mm -hmm. I have some interview where talk you again, bye-bye. Thank you again, bye-bye. Thank okay. you, bye-bye. Yes, thank you again significa gracias de nuevo. Thank you again. Gracias nuevamente. Thank you again. So now let me ask you, how many Melbourne buildings are there? How many? Or there are four buildings. There are. Number two, where is the building where Will wants to go locate it? It's down the street on the left side. Okay, it's down the street on the left side or it's on Main Street. On Main Street. On Main Street. On Main Street. Yes, okay. And how many training centers are there? There are a lot. And where are they? Between Main and King Street. Correct. Between. Between Main and King Street. Very good. So now, 
before continuing, let's see. So teacher, what is the meaning of a lot of? A lot of. A lot of means muchos. For example, we were talking with Irvin and Irma. Vamos hablando con Irvin and Irma. For example, si queremos decir, hay muchos gatos. There are a lot of, a lot of uh, cats. Hay muchos gatos. Now, si queremos decir, hay muchos perros. There are a lot of dogs. So what you need to see, guys, is that we always use plural. We, al we always use plural. Yes, plural. Okay. So give me examples. Give me examples with there are a lot of. Give me examples. Teacher, he, uh, yes. I have a, I, I have a lot of cats. So I, yes, I have a lot of cats. Yo tengo muchos gatos. Okay. Yes, I have. Yes, I have a lot of cats. Or I have a lot of dogs. Or I have a lot of... I have a lot of apples. I have a lot of oranges. I have a lot of uh, sure. pen pencils. Yes. Y, y, también se puede ocupar, digamos, uh, tengo mucho trabajo. I have a lot of work. Okay. Yes. Tengo mucho trabajo. A lot of. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Brian, help us reading there is singular and Marcelo, there are, plural. Uh, there is an ATM across the street. And uh, there's a recruitment center at the corner of Roosevelt Street and Pierce Avenue. Mm -hmm. There's no Dotting factory around the corner. Okay. There are a lot of um, companies down the street. There are some supermarkets on the right up left side of the street. Mm -hmm. There are no hospitals on barrio, barrios, barrios, street. Yes, there are some. There are some, some means, algunos. There are some supermarkets. Algunos supermercados. Yes. So now, hay algunos gatos. There are some cats. There are some dogs. There are some apples. There are some students yes plural 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 okay so now let's answer the exercises okay number one uh-huh there is or there are there is marketing presentation there across is. the street in the morning okay there is a there is a marketing presentation across the street in the morning. Number two, include a sum. There are. There are. There are. There are. Some. Some. Some business workshops. ¿Qué dijimos que era workshops, guys? Do you remember? Workshop? Yeah. Oh. Talleres. Yes. Okay. Un workshop es un taller, pero no es un taller eh, como donde usted va al mecánico, no. Un workshop es un taller donde usted va a aprender. So, number three. They are. There are. 
there are no. there are no recruitment centers around my building. Hmm. Number four. They are. Hmm. A store on the corner yes. of Roosevelt Street uh, in Second Avenue. There is. There is. There, no, there, there is, is no. no. There is no store on the corner of Roosevelt Street and Second Avenue. Number five. They are. There. There, there. There are banks behind the factory I work. And the last one? Aranza building around the corner. There is. There is. There, um, is, um, there is an Aranza building around the corner. Very good. Do you have any question? Preguntas. Not right now? Okay. So let's move. I'm going to, yes. So let's move. What you are going to do with your partner, we are going to go to the breakout rooms again, and you are going to answer true or false according to the picture with your partner, okay? So con su compañerito a resolver esto, okay? There is and there are, de acuerdo a la imagen que usted ve, okay? Once you have finished this, please move to this one. And here you need to do some research. Aquí tiene que investigar. Describe the objects in the classroom. Teacher, how do you say tijeras? How do you say pinceles? How do you say eh, bandera? How do you say cartulina? How? Tiene que investigar. Okay, with this one. So I need you to describe. Me va a describir qué ve. Le voy a dar unos minutitos para que termine esto. Yes. Y después venimos nuevamente al salón. Okay. So let me create the rooms. There you go. There are, dice si hay seis pinturas, si hay, perdón, si hay seis personas en, en la imagen. Eh, dos, cuatro, seis con el bebé. With the baby. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis. In English. True. True. Uh, six. One, six, 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 six people. There are six people. Ajá, so it is false. False. Yes, false. No, I see it. I say. Um, there is a cat on chair. Yes, true. True. Very good. True. There is a woman, a woman. standing behind the sofa. True. Ah, uh, pues, pues, no sé si es mujer. Yes. Okay. Es que se me ve, no sé si, <laughs> no sé si es a mí, pero la, se ve bien empañada la imagen. Really? No, pero no se ve así, fíjense. No, yo la veo clara. Yes, quizás es, es, es su internet, Erwin. Sí, yo creo. But ok. <laughs> okay. There are some books there are on the coffee there table. There are some books on the table. Yes, there are any cups on the tablet? On the table. On the table. On the, on the table. table. Yes. Uh, uh, so, so, mm -hmm. 
Ajá. Entonces, si sí, es verdadero. Ajá. Bueno, Ajá, sí. Ajá, la sí. tercera es, es true, del lado que se vea, porque la otra está, pero mm. está en guión. Uh -huh. Pero esta sí está detrás, que es Sí. La, la otra, the arm and cups on the table. Cups, cups. Oh, the Four. Ah. There, there aren't oh. any cups on the table. There aren't mm -hmm. any cups. A cup, la taza. Well, está en. Ajá. Uh -huh, ah, sí, hay una. Hay, está verdadero. Sí, sí verdadero está. Porque está on. It's true in English. True. It's true. Mm -hmm. Sorry. It's true. Um, five. Under the coffee and table. Under, there are some books on the coffee. Under, no, uh, under, uh, uh, abajo. Mm -hmm. Abajo, under. Ah, sí, abajo, under. Ah, entonces, false. De la, cafa, de la mesa café. Ajá. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Los libros. Cinco, son, cinco. Son cinco sí, true, it's true. True. Mm -hmm. true. Any... Porque ya sí digo que cops there aren't any cops on the table. Para mí es true. There aren't any cups on the table. ¿Qué es cups, dicho? Tazas. Ah, pues sí, es true. It's true, pero ahí dice, there aren't, no hay ninguna. No hay ninguna. Oh. Ah, pues es false. False, because we have one, there is one. Yes. Mm -hmm. De ahí la five sería, there are some books on, under the, the coffee, coffee table. table. Ajá. Si están debajo de la mesa es true. True. Uh -huh. Viene, creo. Cabal. Como. Recording in progress. Recording in progress. Yes, ok. Do you have any questions? Soy visionario. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Eh, sí, vea que en el, en el de, describe the object in the classroom es, es investigar lo que no sabemos. Correct. True, true, fucking, true, fucking. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. Yes, yeah, so here, just true or false, but this one, you need to investigate what you don't know. For example, you are going to describe the objects in the classroom, right? So yeah. there is, there is a, how do you say, tijera? Scissor. Okay, so there are scissors, okay? And there is. There is because it's one scissor. Oh, no. Sí, solo veo una. Okay, but remember that scissors is plural. Uh, scissors, tijeras. Ajá, tijeras. Mm -hmm. So, how do you say borradores? How many erasers? Ajá, yeah. how many erasers do you see? How many erasers? Want you. Three. Three, er uh -huh. there are three erasers. Three eraser. Uh -huh. It's correct, it's correct to say, and uh, there, there is a, there are a lot of children. There are a lot of children, yes. So there is, how do you say this? There is a? A clock. A clock. There is a? Uy. Uh, you need state. <laughs> no, okay. So that's what you need to do. Eso es lo que tiene que hacer porque cómo se dice bandera. Eso tiene que investigar. Okay. All right. I'm, continue. All right. Continue. Okay. Continue. Let me see. I'm going to go with Franklin. Do you have any question? No, baby. no, no. No. Okay. No. All right. So. Continue, okay? We have okay. around three minutes, okay? Three minutes and we go back. Okay. Yes. Next to Charles. 
Hay un perro. There is. Uh, there is a no. dog. There is. Yo no, a... ni... yo no veo ningún perro ahí. No, there is a small dog next to a chair. No, there is not. No, there is not. No. So it's. Uh -huh. Y solo eso era, no, ahí está la, la, la otra image. Que, yes. que de, de escribir lo que está en el salón de clases. Mm -hmm. eh, por ejemplo, por ejemplo, por ejemplo, there is a TV. Correct. Uh, there is a uh, child, child, children's. There are, there are children. Uh, okay. Uh, there are child. Um. No, no es, no es chairs, no es silla. Oh, oh, there is, how many chairs? Chairs. Chairs. Uh -huh. There is a uh, pencils. There is a uh, pencils or there are? There are. Mm -hmm. Yes. There is a table. There is a table. Okay, bandera, como se, se pronuncia, teacher? Oh, flag. 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 F -L -A -G. F-L-A-G. Flag. Okay. Entonces sería, there is a flag. A flag. Uh -huh. Correct. There is a flag. Yes. There is el pegamento está también. There is a tijera. There is cut, no. Eh, espérame, que es que hay una sacapunta, creo que no sé. Tijera cut, no, o cortar es. No, cut, no, cut, no. No, cut es cortar. Tijera. Tijera. El Google dice que dice es Sizor. <risa> ¿Qué dice la <risa> Es que no le creo yo a Google, no le creo, pero no me gusta. Hay cosas traducir. que no, ajá. Ajá, no, no. Ok, a there pie. is ah. a pair, there is a pair of scissors, well. Ah, sí era entonces la palabra. Yes, um, but mm. no, no, es, no es un par de tijeras nada más. Uh, we have two pair of scissors. So there are two pair of are uh, one, two. Yes, two. Three, two, two. Mm. Uh, yes, only only two, only two. No. no. Only two, right? Solo una vez. Mm -hmm. Do, two. Two, two pairs. Two. Two pairs. Okay. Two pairs. There are two in pairs. There are. Yes. Yes. Okay. There are two parts. Pairs. Pairs. Pair of scissors. Of scissors. Mm. Okay. Okay. Ah.
os. Qué rara la palabra. Uh -huh. uh, podría ser de R. Shire. In the. In the room. Oh, there are five. Well, no, there are more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. There are five. one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, eight, six. Nine. Nine. Los cuatro niños, son, la otra, um, y one, la que está atrás, toma en cuenta como una silla también. La de Rodos. Hay una teach, la teach. Uh, no, okay, so we, we, oh, okay, you said chairs or children? No, chair. Ah, chairs. Sí, yes, uh -huh, sí. yes. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Yes. Okay. Yes, six. Mm -hmm. There, there are six chairs. 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 In the... In the room. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. There is the there. Uh -huh, there is. There is uh, a desk in the room. In the room. Uh -huh. mm. There is a reloj on the wall there is el reloj. a, el there reloj. Is a clock. A clock. A clock. A clock there is a clock on the wall on the wall correct mm -hmm. on the wall um there are people Okay, guys, there are seven people in the picture. True or false? False. False. Number two, there is a cat on a chair. True or false? False. Why? Why false? Uh, for on the sofa. <laughs> there is a cat on the sofa, okay. Number three, there is a woman standing behind a sofa. Uh, true. True, yes, a standing, parada, okay? There aren't any cups on the table, true or false? False. False. There are some books under the coffee table, true or false? True. 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 There true. is a small chair in front of the coffee table. Uh, true. true, yes, a oh. small chair. We have it right there. There aren't, there aren't any children in the living room. True or false? False. False, false right? False. And there are some flowers in front of a man. True or false? False. 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 And there is a fan in the picture. A fan. True. 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 Okay. There is a small dog next to a chair. Brian. There False. is a small dog. False. Okay. False. Okay. False. Yes. Okay. So now describe the picture. I want to know 
What do you see right here? There is a TV. There is a TV. There are a that clock. There is a clock. There, there are, are children. A student. There are students. Uh -huh. There, there are five is brushes. a child. There are five brushes. There are. There are six chairs. There are six chairs. Chairs. Uh -huh. Chair. Yes. Uh -huh. What else? There, there are a, a lot of shoes. There is. There are a lot of shoes. Oh, there are a lot of shoes. Yes. There yes. is a clock. There is a clock. Uh -huh. There are five there brushes. A clock. There is a clock. Okay. Yes. What else? What else do you see? There is a whiteboard. There is a whiteboard. Uh -huh. What else? There, there are five is brushes. Four. There Brush. is. There, there is a window. There is a there is a window. One. There, there is, is a door. There is a door. There are a lot of. Is a there toilet. is a teacher. There is a teacher. Okay. A paper dispenser. Very good. How do you say this in English? Mire, fíjese bien esto. How do you say this? In okay, this one is a paper. Towel dispenser. Paper towel dispenser. Dispensador de papel. Yes, this one. El papel como papel toalla donde uno se seca las manos. The paper towel dispenser. Yes. Okay. okay. Paper towel dispenser. Okay. And how many? How many children do you see? How many children? Nine. Nine children. How many, how many erasers do you see? Three. Three erasers. Yes. And how many pairs of scissors do you see? Two. Two, right? And how many markers do you see? Eight. Eight? Eight. Eight markers? Okay, one, two, three. Four. There is one, there is one on the on the table, like two, three, four, five, six, seven. Mm -hmm. eight. Okay. okay, there are eight markers. Okay, all right, very good. Ah, how do you say bandera? Flag. 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 Okay, very good. <laughs> so now, okay, let's see. Suleima, help us reading the sentences. There is a bathroom in my bedroom, and so on. There is a bathroom in my bedroom. There is a room in my bedroom. There is a dresser in my bedroom. Mm -hmm. There is a garage in my house. Mm -hmm. There is a garage. computer oh, in my yeah. bedroom. Computer in my bedroom. Mm -hmm. There is an oven in my kitchen. Very good. What is the meaning of dresser? What is the meaning of dresser? Dresser means tocador. Dresser. Okay. Un tocador. Dresser. What is the meaning of rug? What is the meaning of rug? Rug is alfombra. Rug is alfombra. So let me ask you guys. Uh, tell me what is in your house. Tell me what is in your house. Tell me what is your house? There is, uh huh? 
there is, uh, well, in my case, in my house, I have one, two, three, four, five. There are five windows. There are five windows. Many windows. What about you? There are four doors. There are four doors. Okay. Very good. Uh -huh. There are two tables. There are two tables. Very good. Uh -huh. There are two dogs. There are two dogs. Okay. Uh -huh. there, are there are four chairs. There are four chairs. There is a TV, okay. How many TVs do you have, guys? How many TVs do you have? Brian says three. And the other ones? Erika, how many TVs do you have? One TV. One TV, okay, very good. Erika, help me reading this, please. Read the questions. What in your bathroom? Mm -hmm. What is your bedroom? What is your dining room? What's in? What's in your kitchen? Okay. What is your living room? What's in your living room? So, K I N. What's in your bathroom? K I N su ban. What's in your bathroom? What's in your bedroom? What's in your dining room? What's in your kitchen? And what's in your living room? Homework. Tarea para mañana. Responder todas estas preguntas. ¿Qué hay en su baño? ¿Qué hay en su cuarto? ¿Qué hay en su uh, comedor? ¿Qué hay en su cocina? ¿Y qué hay en su sala? Al menos tres cosas me va a decir mañana de qué hay en su casa. Ok, recuerde there is or there are, quiero oraciones completas. Ok, oraciones completas. All right, so now let me, um, let me take attendance again. Ok, let me take the attendance. Eh, Brian Antonio Castro Molina. Present. Yes. Cristian Marcelo Ramírez Morán. Present. Elmer Alexander Coto Sorto. Eric Alexander Escalante Barrillas. Erika Beatriz Reyes Méndez. Present. Thank you. Franklin Emanuel Flores Portillo. Present. Thank you. Gerson José Abarcaranda. Irma del Tránsito Alegría Martínez. Present. Irving Francisco Peraza Herrera. Irving. Present. Thank you. Yvette Elvira Aquino Peña. Present. Thank you. Johnny Iván Argueta Argueta. José Enrique Silesar Alas. Jocelyn Guadalupe Romero Évora. Kelvin Omar Martínez Ramírez. Liliana Beatriz Jiménez Colorado. Present. Thank you. Luis Ernesto Nuila Castro. Ok. Marco Rubén García Rodríguez. Present. Reinaldo Alberto Vázquez Torres. Tania Vanessa Moreno Navas. En Zuleima Guadalupe Chicas Aguila. Present. Thank you. Okay, guys. We are going to take this quiz. Vamos a tomar el pequeño examen que tenemos este día. So, what I need to do is I, I need to go to the spreadsheet. Well, I'm going to send it right here, okay? So, lo voy a mandar aquí. Lo que pueden irse al spreadsheet, váyase ahí de ahí lo toma. Okay? So this is the link. That is the link for the test. Ese es el, el link del examen. Ahora, ¿qué va a poner de contraseña? De contraseña va a poner English 2022. Esa es la contraseña. Nombre completo. Okay? Full name. Full name. Full name. You have five minutes to finish.
If you have questions, let me know. Si tiene preguntas, me las hace. Pero no del examen, si no de, de, sino puede entrar, ¿ok? Eh, aparece eh, y el nombre, eh, prefijo, teléfono, celular. Eso es, ¿verdad, Ticha? No. 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 Um, se lo mandé aquí en el chat. Irma, en el chat. Ok, ya voy. Tiene que ser en mayúscula la contraseña. Yes. Así como está escrita ahí. So you need to see. Tiene que ver una pantalla así. Así va a ver la pantalla. Ok, ya entré. Very good. Ok. Continue. Ok. Me aviso cuando haya terminado. Ok. Please let me know once you finish. Cuando okay. ya termine me va a decir done. Ok, done teacher, done, como ya, listo, terminado, done, ok. Teacher, ya no puedo ingresar. Why, Marcelo? Done, teacher, terminé. Eh, yes. <coughs> Me sale código de acceso no válido. Copia y péguelo, nada más. Ok. Yeah, copy and paste. Ok, Irving, you finish. Ok, Irving, you finish. Ok, Irving, uh, now that you finish, Irving, please continue yes. with the... ¿Mande? Continue with the other one. I send it in the chat. Se lo mandé en el, en el chat. El que, le, el que le continúa este. Ok. Let me see. Ok, Erwin. Let me see your score. Vamos a ver su nota. Me equivoqué en tres, creo. Yes. Ok. Listo. Don. Don. Yes. Okay. Okay. So I fail three. Okay. I fail three. Let me see. Okay. I got Brian. I got Irvin. I got Yvette. I got Marco. Okay. I got Christian. Okay. I got Liliana, okay. I'm missing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm missing four. Cuatro de ustedes me falta. I got Franklin, okay. Go, teacher. Don, okay. Don. Okay, go. Irma. Okay. Don. 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 Yes. Okay. I'm missing one. One. I'm missing one. Tierra Sassan, teacher. Ah, yes. Yes. Hay otro, no. Eh, yes, I send it in the chat. Aquí en el chat se los mandé el otro. Eh, let me see. Okay. Okay, I got Erika. En su lema. Ok. I'm going to show su lema. Ok. Vamos a ver de su lema. Ok. Look at my screen. Ok. Look at my screen, guys. Miren mi pantalla. Look at my screen. 
Vamos a resolverlo juntos para que aclaremos dudas. Yes. So we have number one. Okay. There is or there are. There are. There are because we there have are. plural. Dogs. Now number two. There is or there are. There, there is. is. There is. There is sugar in the tea. ¿Por qué es there is y no there are? Porque no podemos decir hay azúcares en el té. Decimos hay azúcar. Singular. Singular. So, there is sugar. Okay. Number three. There are or there is? There are. Because there we are. have three pencils. Repeat after me and say pencils. pencils. Number four. There is or there are? There are. There are. People es plural. People mm. is gente, personas. Entonces, ¿cómo se dice persona? Se dice person. Person. Mm. Person. And person has its plural. And what is its plural? People. Okay. Person, una. People, dos o más. So, there are people on the bus. Okay. okay. What about number five? Correct or incorrect? Correct. Because we have third person and we have S. She writes a letter. Escribir. Writes. Okay. Number six. She doesn't write a letter. Incorrect or correct? Incorrect. Okay. Because remember that if we have the auxiliary verb, we should not, not add S. Sin la S, right? What about number seven? Correct or incorrect? Incorrect. Why? Because we have S and no. No S because we have auxiliary verb. Number eight, what she does right, correct or incorrect? Incorrect. Why? ¿Por qué es incorrecto, Suleima? Porque se tiene que poner what does she. Excellent. Porque la estructura no es así. The structure is not like that. So we should say, what does she right? Okay. What does she write? Number nine. I don't drink tea. The structure is not I drink no tea. No, no es estructura. I not drink tea. Tampoco es la estructura. And the last one. The museum... Esto es singular, el museo. No estamos hablando de plural, entonces tenemos que ponerle la S. The museum opens at 10 o'clock. Do you have any question? Preguntas, dudas, questions? Ok. Let's move and let's then take this one. Okay, so we need to create questions. Look at this one. There is a banana in the bowl. Is there a banana in the bowl? Question. So what is the question of this one? There are two books on the desk. Is there? No. No. There is. Are, there are, perdón. Are there. Are there. Two books on the desk. Two books on the desk. Yes. Uh -huh. Next. 
There are six sandwiches in the basket. Are there six are there? in the basket? Are there six sandwiches in the basket? Next. Is there? Is there? An elephant? An elephant in the zoo? Okay. In the zoo? Okay. Next. Are there five kites in the sky? Are there five kites in the sky? Okay. Next. there a... I was behind the street. Okay, repeat after me and say behind. Behind. The tree, very good. Okay. Yes, choose and write there is and there are. There is a gym. There is a girl, girl, girl in front of the house. Number three. There are. There are. There are three mice under your bed. Okay, so number four. There, there are, are three in the wall. There are it two. Okay. Are number five. There, there is there an ice cream in the There place. is. There is an there ice cream. There is an ice cream. Mm -hmm. Hay un helado. There yeah. is an ice cream. Number six. There are. There are. There are three books on your desk. Okay, now. Uh huh. Are there five chairs in the class? Are there five chairs in the class? Number three. Are. Are there twenty are tomatoes? There. On the are there. Repeat after me and say tomatoes. Tomatoes. Yes. Tomatoes. Number four. Is there? Is there a cinema is there? in your city? Is there? Is there yes. Number five. Are there? Uh, are there a X in the plate? Number six. Is there is a banana in the bowl? Board? In the bowl. Okay. So there are three schools. One, two, and three. How many parks do we have? How many parks? One. One. Two. Two. There is two. There is two. There are two. There are two, there there are two parks. Two there are parks. two parks. How many zoos do we have? There is, there is one. There, there is two. one zoo. How many supermarkets do we have? One. There two. are two. There are, there are two. two. There are two. Yes, there are two. And how many library do we have? How many libraries? One. There is. There is, there is, there one, is one. One library. One library. How many toy shops do we have? Toy shops. Mm -hmm. There are, there, two. Are two. there are two toy shops. Toy shop. Yes. How many museums do we have? There is one. There is, there is one. one. And how many cinemas do we have? There is there is there is one one cinema? Cinema. Two. two. There are two. two. There, there are, are two. two. There, there are, are two. two. Yes, there are two. Okay. Okay. Now, look at exercise four and ask and answer. Okay. Is there a library? Yes, there is. So let's create the questions. Uh huh. Are there six cinemas? Answer. No. 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 There. They are. There are. Okay. Three. 
Are there five schools? Are there five schools? Okay. Aha, uh -huh. answer. No, there aren't. No, no there, there aren't. aren't. Next. Is there a zoo? A zoo? Is there, there a zoo? There. A zoo? Yes, there answer. Is. Yes, there is. Yes, there is. Number five. Are there, are there two, are there parks? two parks? Are there two parks? Answers? The... Yes. Yes. Yes, there are. Yes, there are. are. Next, number six. Is there... There are... Peter. Peter. Uh-huh. Yeah. A theater? No. No, there are. No. No. No, there, there are. No, there. There is. There is. There is. There there is. There is. Aha. Very good. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Very good. Do you have any question? Questions? Questions? No? So, how many people are there in your family? How many people are there in your family? There are six people in my family. What about you? There are four people in my family. Excellent. Family. Uh-huh. What about you, Marcelo? How many people are there in your family? There, uh -huh. there. There are. Uh -huh. How many people? There are uh, five. People, people in my family. Perfect. How many people are there in your family, Brian? There are four people in my family. Yes. How many people are there in your family, Franklin? Um... Are there there uh, family? How many people are there in your family, Franklin? How many people? Cuántas personas hay en su familia? How many people? Um, four. There four are men, there are four people. people. Yes. People. How many people are there in your family, Suleyma? They are six. There people. are. There. There. No, not there they. Are. There. Uh -huh. there. There. There are six. Yes. Arabin, how many people are there in your family? Three. There are. There are three. How many? Three people. Three people, sorry. Yes. Okay, guys. Before we go, before we go, antes de irnos, do you have any question, guys? Alguien que tenga alguna pregunta de los temas? Uh -huh. Nobody? No? Okay, so before we go, antes que nos vayamos, Tom Twister. Fuzzy Woozy was a bird. Fuzzy Woozy had no hair. Fuzzy Woozy wasn't very fuzzy. Was he? Okay, so one by one. Marco? Fuzzy Woozy had... <laughs> Don't worry. Se me traba la lengua. Okay. Fuzzy Woozy was a beer. Fuzzy Woozy had no hair. Fuzzy Woozy wasn't very fuzzy. Was he? Good, Yvette. 
Fussy Goosey was a bear. Fussy Goosey had no hair. Fussy Goosey wasn't very fussy, but he. Good, Irving. Fussy Goosey was a bear. Fussy Goosey had not hair. Fussy Goosey wasn't very fussy, but he. Okay, remember bear. Bear, bear, bear. Bear. Irma. Pussy Pussy was a bear. Pussy Pussy had no hair. Pussy Pussy was very pussy. What he? Okay. Suleima. Pussy Pussy was a bear. Pussy Pussy had no hair. Pussy Pussy wasn't very pussy. Was he? Okay. Franklin. Pussy Pussy was a bear. Pussy Pussy had no hair. Pussy Pussy was very funny, was here. Okay, Erika? Pussy Pussy was a bear, Pussy Pussy has no hair. Pussy Pussy was very Pussy was he. Okay, wasn't. Marcelo? Pussy Pussy was a bear, Pussy Pussy had no hair. Pussy Pussy wasn't bear, Pussy. Pussy was he. Okay. All right. And the last one, Brian. Pussy Woosie was a beard. Pussy Woosie had no hair. Pussy Woosie wasn't very fussy, was he? Okay. All right, guys. Don't forget about your homework, please. No se le va a olvidar su tarea para mañana. Okay. This. All right, guys. So I'll see you back tomorrow. I hope you have a good night. Go ahead and rest. Descanse. Okay? Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, Good night guys. Good night.